Hey guys, it's Tanya. I am so excited to be able to share a review of um, paper packs from my friend's shop, Aloha Creations. And her shop is a little corner shop and it's on IG, um, Instagram for you guys who don't know. Um, and uh, it will open October 1st. So I wanted to do an honest review, so I did pay for the items that I have. So you guys will know, you know, the feel of it, what you're getting, you know, if it is a good purchase, which I already know it is. So um, I'm not going to even worry about that because I know my friend and I know she is an overachiever. So I know she is not going to give us anything but good quality things. So I um, received, um, I got a nature pack. I got a travel one. This one is pretty heavy too. And then I got the vintage paper. And then also I got the wallpaper. Okay. So I got the wallpaper packs. And then um, this is, uh, I think these are cards. These, these are um, cards, I believe. So I'm going to open up everything, but I just want to give you guys an overview of what I got. Okay. And then I asked her for a favor. I asked her if she could make me a blue um ephemera trim fabric thing um of vintage things um to go with this uh blue fairy journal that i'm doing so i'm going to show you guys the cover really quick i'm not done at all but this is the cover right and let's see what she gave me so when you open it up y'all look at that isn't that going to go perfect so i got some laces and Y'all, then she gave me um, a wood embellishment. I got some sequins, butterfly. Oh, this is so cute. Wouldn't that look cute on a tag? And then she gave me a button, another button. Love that. And look at this. Look at this trim, y'all. Yeah, so cute. This is like velvet right here. And then look at this one. Oh my goodness, I love that. Then I got some blue playing cards. I think these are going to be perfect. Uh, this is, oh my goodness, look at that, y'all. Can you see that? Isn't that cute? You can put that on some tags or on some, uh, like make a cluster, a page cluster. So cute. And then we got some vintage laces. Oh my goodness, look at this. Oh, guys, it's going to look so pretty. I cannot wait to use all this. This is gorgeous. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so that is my custom blue um, embellishment box, and I love this. I, Y'all, this is so cool. It's perfect. What do you guys think? I, I think it's perfect. So I'm, I know I'm butchering that because she had it in there. So pretty, so neat. Okay. So, we are going to start with, um, let's, let's open this one first, okay? And look how she has it packaged. Isn't that cute? I believe this is vintage right here. And then, um, so it would be cute to add to a journal. Oh, guys, I know what these are. They are cards, vintage cards. Isn't that cute? From from um like different countries and stuff. I'm just dropping stuff everywhere. So we got some from Switzerland, Scotland. Oh my goodness. And there's a lot in here. Cuba. Capri, Italy. Look at that. That's perfect. Now this this is so perfect. And I love the size of them. So those those are cute. Okay. And then we got the wallpaper. So I believe her wallpapers come um, in colors. So you can get different color packs. So um, I got a, a green one because you, if you don't know, I love green. Green is one of my favorite colors. So um, I got the green. So let's see. Alright, so this is pretty. I love the size of them. Look at this. 
can you guys you guys can't see that but it's got like little gold dots in there so cute I absolutely love vintage wallpaper um, I like the texture and everything about it so and you guys these are not like little baby pieces either they're they're a good size this is um, it has to be like eight and a half by eleven or a little bit bigger than eight and a half by eleven. Hold on, let me just, let me check. Yep. It is eight and a half by eleven. Okay, so this is this is some good pieces. You can definitely fold this over and make uh, some really cute journal covers with this. So that is the green one. And then um y'all I am like just putting everything everywhere. Then we have the floral. Okay, and I'm really excited about these wallpapers. It is so hard for me to find vintage wallpapers. So, um, to know that um, there's a shop where you can get decent pieces and it's not going to like break the bank, I'm all in. And it did not take long to come. Um, so, it ships from Canada, and I am in Illinois. I believe it took maybe maybe a week so that's pretty cool so uh, this is this one cute look at this y'all tell me that's not cute right wrap it around a page or make it into a, a side oh love that love the pretty colors in this one as well and then look at this one so cute and then we have this one I love this I yeah, I don't, I don't know if I want to ever use this one. This one is pretty. I think this one is my favorite. Okay, so that is that. Definitely um, hoard worthy. <laughs> so I can see myself hoarding some of these things. Okay, so that is the um, floral. And then we have the brown. So this one is like a more of a fall color patch, which... I love and I'm sorry for shaking the camera um, okay hold on and I hope you guys can see um, I probably should have took these out beforehand so I'm sorry about that okay so love these look at these colors y'all look at this the greens and the rust perfect Oh, look at this one. It's got like shimmer. Can you see that? Isn't that cute? Cute, 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 cute. Love this one as well. Okay. And then we got some little ones. Okay. I love these. I, I love everything. And I'm not just saying that. I, I like it because I do buy a lot of stuff I buy a lot of vintage stuff I buy a lot of paper packs and you want to feel like you're getting your money's worth right so um, that's why I am reviewing it for I wanted I, I wanted to know and um, I feel like I got my money's worth already just with the blue tin and the uh, wallpapers so this one is vintage okay so let's see what we got in here Oh my. Okay, so we got some vintage stamps. Okay. And then we got some more. Look at that. Even the sleeve is cute, right? I love that. And then, oh, she made it into like a little pocket. Like, um, and this is cute. So you have vintage things and cutouts and stuff like that in here. I absolutely love this, y'all. Let's, let's take it out so we can see. Oh, yeah. So, uh, some vintage things from vintage books and things like that. I don't know. I think this is just a vintage, uh, it feels, it feels like rice paper. But I don't think that's rice paper. I don't know. I would have to ask her, but I love the texture of it. Um, and then you, uh, flip it over like this. And you have some more cutouts. Y'all, I'm loving everything about this. I really do look at that I love that um and then we have some more okay 
perfect perfect because I know these came from vintage books and things like that so I know everything is vintage in here um, and it's perfect that they are cut out I love that um, I love how she made this little pocket too I like that idea okay so we're gonna put this so we got some um, vintage uh, what are those tickets okay and then we got this um, a whole book guys a whole book so this is a book of poetry looks like uh, and look at the color blue so you already know that it's gonna go into my fairy journal look at that look at this one this is the perfect page love that okay and then we have some um, we have a vintage postcard a vintage letter okay some vintage book pages which are perfect and they are full sheets they're not half sheets they are totally full so you can definitely sew that into a signature and then you have some more pages um, y'all these these are perfect um, oh I thought it opened up <laughs> like that I'm tripping um, these are perfect for like okay like me I don't have a lot of vintage things and that's okay you know, but when I get packs like this, this is perfect because if I'm making a journal or two journals, then I can put, you know, one, like I could put one side in one journal, one side in the other, and I'll have just enough and um, it won't cause it to clutter so much, you know, because I have, I have a problem with over cluttering, you know, I love this. This, one. this is some vintage music paper so these packets are perfect just perfect okay this is perfect I love this I love everything about it okay so I'm gonna put that over here and now we have the travel one so this is how it comes okay and we're gonna undo the ribbon which I do love we're gonna put that over here okay and then we're gonna just open it. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. What? What we got? What we got? Okay. Uh oh. Okay. Oh. All right. So we have some postcards. Love this. And then we have a um, printout of a postcard, which I love. Um, we have some Polaroids cutouts, which I love that too. More postcards. Y'all, and the postcards are so pretty. I love them. You know, these are like postcards I probably would never even get in my uh, area. So that is, that's cool all in itself. Um, I love the envelope. Look at that. And then this is full with tickets. Okay. Oh, and then what we got? Oh, look at this. So right here, you already know. So and it's got like, um, like where somebody stuck stickers down or whatever. So you already know this is perfect for a journal, for a travel journal right here. So I love the fact that you get full books in her uh, packets. So then you could do whatever you want. Isn't that cute? So I know this is a vintage um, uh, directory book. Or yeah, it is. And then you get a map. Um, this is cool. I mean, look how big that thing is. So you know that that's cool. And then I got some more. Um, postcard uh, things and I like how they flip over I like that and then this is let's see what this is I'm gonna try to hurry up but guys I know I'm going really slow oh more stamps that's perfect this would be perfect for collaging the cover um, I just I'm really really truly impressed y'all uh, not that I didn't think I was going to be, but I'm really impressed. I, this, she did an amazing job putting these together. For real. And then you get pages. 
and that is cool too. You know, like let's say if you did, um, let's say we did three signatures. So this could be folded like this, you know, in one signature, and you can fold the other one like this. So this is cool, you know, um, definitely cool. Love that. This is perfect. And you get a lot in here. So, um, a lot of ephemera to put in your journals. I, I have a, a problem always of finding ephemera. The correct ephemera for the appropriate journal, I think. Look at this. So this is the nature one. I love the trim um, that she put on here. I like the I like the fact that all the trim matches, uh, <laughs> matches the journal pack. So this is what it looks like. And I'm excited. Nature one. It's kind of my jam, y'all. I love nature stuff. So we got a little printout card, a doily. Okay. And then we got a ribbon trim. Love this, especially the green ones and the reds. And then we got some gorgeous, gorgeous book pages. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And of course we got us some Edith Holden pages. And they are not just half pages. They are full sheets. Um, I'm cool with the text too. Because Edith Holden text is just gorgeous. So it doesn't matter if it doesn't have um, anything on it. I just love Edith Holden. Period. So look at that. I love it. And then, so I got one, two, three, four, five, five. That's pretty generous, y'all. Look at that one. So most of you guys already know what these holding pages look like. Oh my goodness, look at these. I love these. I would never be able to find stuff like that here. And that's what I love about getting, um, look at this. Oh, cute, guys. And then we have this one. Oh. I love the books that she um, pulled from. I think they're gorgeous. The pages are gorgeous. And then we have another doily keeping everything together. And then we have this gorgeous um, paper clip which I would never be able to curl that. I tried it. But my paper clips don't turn out like that at all. I love these books that she has. Look at that. She has some amazing things, some amazing books. So this is totally worth my money. Totally worth it. Um, totally worth it, guys. I hope you check her out. Um, so remember that her shop opens, um, October 1st. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Look at that one. And then she included a fern. And this is something she pressed herself. I already know it. That is Aloha. I know she pressed it. Isn't that gorgeous? I didn't even want to use it, but it's so pretty. But what I was saying is, okay, so, um... She opens her shop October 1st. I hope you guys go and check her out. Um, the packs are really, really good. Um, I love that you can um, get different themes. And I also love that you can ask her to make you a certain theme as well. So please, y'all, show my girl some love at a little corner shop on IG. And mark your calendars is October 1st. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the review. Um, yeah. God bless, guys. Bye.